welcome to Titan Professional Videos. I'm James Davoli, the product manager. Today we're answering the question, is Fireblock Foam open cell or closed cell? Well, first we want to talk about what is a one component polyurethane foam and how do we find out if it is open cell or closed cell? One, one component polyurethane foam is that foam that you find in a can that is quite literally made to apply to a gun applicator and or to a straw and then be applied in small areas. Much different than two component. Now this one component that we're talking about today is fire block, which is made to stop the draft air from fueling the fire. And we're looking at an electrical box, the back side. Uh, this is the garage, in, garage entrance. And this is the back side of an electrical box. You have one here as well. Uh, but what, what we're gonna do is show how fire block foam especially the Titan Professional Fireblock Foam, is a combination of open cell and closed cell. So in order to see that, you kind of have to see what does the foam look like underneath the skin. So when we're talking about open cell and closed cell, closed cell is going to be this outermost layer, the actual skin of the foam, the rough, rigid part. Now, Fireblock Foam also has open cell. And that's what's on the internal, underneath the skin. When you peel it back, that is going to be the open cell part of a one component polyurethane foam. So to answer your question, is fire block foam open cell or closed cell? The answer is yes, it's both. It's closed cell on the outside as long as there's no penetrations to the actual foam. As soon as there's penetration, now you have the open cell and that is going to help you understand what is open cell and closed cell. If you have any more questions, please like and comment on this video. Let us know what you're, what you're seeing out in the field and what you'd like to know more about. Thank you and have a great day.